Hi, my name is Beth Koenig. I'm the Director of Deafblind Services for the Orange County Deaf Advocacy Center. And today I'm going to show you our Braille TTY and how it works. So um, first we have uh, the TTY here. And this, um, it has all its things um, marked in Braille to remind us, you know, um, of what's what. Um, is a things with spacebar and whatnot. And attached to it is down here, this is our Alva Braille Terminal. It's a 20 cell terminal um, that has these three um, status cells on it, which makes it really good for TTY use and computer use, um, as long as we're not doing any computer programming. But right now it's set for the Braille TTY. Then over here we have an extra keyboard and this can be used um, by switching this keyboard with this. You can actually have a face-to-face -face communication system similar to that of the original um, Braille TTY, the um, Telebraille. Now this here is a setup that goes on the phone line and this part here is the um, the part that, you know, plugs in the phone. So when the phone rings, this pager that's currently set to off, um, you can set to on or whatever, and um, you just wear it on your belt. Um, and so when the phone rings, this will vibrate. Um, there's also another accessory that actually has desk vibration, you know, where you can actually have the vibrator on the desk, but um, this is portable sonic call unit that's very good, especially if you're doing housework and the phone rings. I mean, you know, that way you know how to answer it. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to turn this on. I'm going to turn on my Braille display first. It makes that crazy sound, pops up with all these letters. I'm going to go ahead and turn on that. And it says here that TT mode ready. Yeah, TTY mode ready. And so I can just start typing. So, hi, this is a test. And that's exactly what's put out on the Braille TTY. Um, his, oops, I missed a T. Um, and then of course I type on this keyboard um, you know, the test. Like I said, I can't play very well. Um, okay, so as you can see, it's printing on the TTY so that, you know, it's printing on the TTY and it's printing on this Braille display. So a deaf blind person can easily read it. Um, now if, what the, hmm, I wonder what this thing, I don't know what this does. <laughs> okay, so we have some other things here that I don't know what is going on. Why is this? Huh! Okay, so this is going to be fun for me to play with. I don't know what's up with that. But that's our rail TTY. Um, also different things. So you can power that off and then you power off this and it's ready to go. This doesn't require any outside power though. So it's, uh, it's pretty good. Um, I hope to get to play with it some more and figure out um, everything it can do because I believe it can do a few more things um, and I'd like to actually have it hooked up to a phone line and get to demo it live. But, you know, right now it's a really good face-to-face -face communication unit, and it's working. Um, so, that's that.